Judge, tell me what you have. Uh, first of all, name and uh, title. I'm a James Madison Justice, Peace Precinct 4, Montgomery County. Tell me what you got. I have a 60 year old, about 60 year old white female. I was in this mobile home and uh, when uh, a rather large oak tree, uh, three to four feet in diameter, came crashing down, uh, she was in the bedroom and uh, she's a fatality here as a result of the tree fact. It's definitely storm related. Uh, the, with the ground being so saturated, uh, with the root system not very deep and the tree leaning toward the home, uh, unfortunately, uh, she lost her life here today. How many, have you had any others like these today? Uh, no, I haven't. This is the first one I know of in the area related to the storm. What kind of storm damage have you seen around here? Uh, mostly just trees, a few trees down here and there, but they weren't from wind, they were from, from uh, the ground being saturated, and uh, with, especially with oak trees with the heavy limbs on one side, uh, they tend to, uh, they'll, they'll uproot fairly easily with little or no wind. What about the flooding? What have you seen? I mean, uh, you get, you've of, been out in it quite a bit. Uh, absolutely. A lot of flooding, a lot of rescues by different departments, fire departments, uh, constables department, just a number of private citizens are out. Some of my family are out now helping rescue folks. Uh, it's, uh, it's devastating in a wide, wide area here that we're seeing. You've been out here all your life. You ever seen this? Uh, definitely not. I'm 61 years old. I haven't seen anything like it. What about 94? I know we had several dams, Bart Lake Dam broke and all, and uh, how does that compare to this? Personally, I think this is a little worse. I, I remember 94 very well. We had some equipment damage from the flood, and it was up on very high ground, but it wasn't high enough. But this is, I believe this is going to surpass that, in my opinion. Okay. All right. My God. Hey, I say. Judge, you said her husband her husband was in the front room? Her husband was in the front room here. She was here in the bedroom. And that's where you can see where the tree collapsed. And they had to make entry in here to extricate it. Well, now these, these roots, I mean, it doesn't look like there's anything there. There's just nothing holding it. it, it they're not as dense. And you'll notice this is sandy loam type ground here as well. Uh, it, it, it's just a recipe for disaster in this type of weather. There's just not much to hold it. And you'll... You won't see it from here, but over there will be a lot of limbs hanging out on that side of the tree. It puts all the weight over there. They're extremely heavy. When the ground gets weakened, it's coming down. I mean, you've been doing timber and everything for years. How old would you say this tree is? Uh, that tree could easily be uh, 50 to, to 75 years old. It held up this long and then it comes down. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's a Golly. Really? They took the chainsaw in there and cut these uh, 